Welcome to the Dactronics tutorial for switching from primary to backup control systems using a show control button. This tutorial outlines creating a script in Venus Control Suite and executing that script from a button in Display Studio in order to switch between primary and backup systems. In a system that is equipped with a backup, there's a backup player as well as a backup processor. The primary and backup devices run independently and are activated within the processor. Processor series include DIP5060, DI6000, and VP6000. When content is created in Content Studio or brought in on an external hard drive, it's always saved to the primary DMP. A software called SyncBack is scheduled to automatically run on the backup player and check for any new or updated content on the primary player, which is then copied to the backup. Buttons in Display Studio play the content to both the primary and backup machines so that at any given point, what's playing on the primary should be what's playing on the backup. Open Venus Control Suite by clicking the icon on your desktop or by browsing to https colon slash slash computer name colon 44300. Log in with the username and password. From the taskbar on the left, select Scripts. Click Add New, then choose Edit. Select Activate Primary or Backup Devices, enter a descriptive name, and click Save. In the Configure Script setting, you will first need to select the display. Click Add Display and check the display or displays desired and click Save. Under Command Parameters, choose which system you wish this script to activate. This example will activate the backup system. Click Save and repeat this process to create another script to switch back to the primary system. Now that the script buttons are created in Venus Control Suite, open Display Studio. Create a new button by right-clicking and selecting New Button. Select the plus sign to add a new line. In Step 1, choose System Control. In Step 2, select Advanced. If Advanced is not an option, choose the hub in the top right corner of Display Studio and go to Properties, Settings. Check the box for Advanced and return to your button. Advanced should now be an option. In Step 3, select Run Fusion Script. In Step 4, leave the protocol set to UDP IP, address to 255.255.255.255, and port set to 27000. Users will need to enter the sign number and file name for the Venus Control Suite script. The standard sign number is 99, however on custom sites this could be uniquely set. The file name needs to match the script name from Venus Control Suite. Activate Main Backup. Name the button and click Save. Repeat this process for the main primary. Click the Main Backup button to run the script. The display will now be running on the backup system. Make sure to check the backup system prior to each event. If running on a backup system, you'll want to switch the imaging service in Display Studio to point to the backup. This will change what the monitor wall looks at and allows you to make new buttons with the primary machine turned off. From the hub in the upper left corner, choose Properties, then Service Configuration. Check the box next to the backup DMP and click OK. This concludes the tutorial for switching from primary to backup control systems. Continue to other videos to learn more about your Dactronics control system.